First, you'll need to download the Mouse Acceleration Fix. A link has been provided in the description below. When the software has opened up, you'll need to click Apply Fix and close the window. Next, you'll need to go into your mouse settings and be sure to disable the Enhanced Pointer Precision. To find the proper dead zone for the game you are playing, you will first need to open the XAIM plugin and navigate to the layout of which you need to tune. Next, you'll need to go into the Layout Options tab and select Mouse Settings. You will first need to be sure to match your mouse DPI to the speed your mouse is using and set the dead zone's shape to rectangle. This will allow us to better see the movement of each axis when finding our dead zones. You will then need to change the radius of the circle test to 1, set the speed to 50, and then enable the circle test. Make sure that the lock XY option is unchecked and start raising the value of your x-axis until your player is looking left and right in-game. You will now need to take note of this value and reset back to zero. You will now need to raise the dead zone of your y-axis until your player is looking up and down in-game. You can now input the x-axis dead zone back into your settings, disable the circle test, and lock your x and y axis values in the dead zone settings. The final step is to change the dead zone shape back to what your game uses. Battlefield 4 uses the ellipse shape. From here you will just need to go into capture mode, get a feel for your mouse, and fine-tune the dead zone to your personal preference. 